the set. Just I'll be quick.
battle. Hogotena, Rob! Pokemon Trainer! How's it going? Just realized my mic was muted for that first uh first match, but that's okay. We're still here. So next, I'm fast able to take the uh, first set. Uh, I mean, the first game of this best of five quite uh, a little convincingly. It was pretty close, but we'll see what happens. Uh, set two. I mean, last Marauder Mayhem, uh, Jax and Astrum were able to take the dub for singles. So we'll have to see what happens. Not a good start. Uh, already, already losing stock. Wow. So interesting angle from fast. It's gonna get start getting edge guarded by Jax. Oh, looks like next comes in to save fast, but now everyone's scrapping in the corner. Ooh, look at that! Sh that. Sh Jack Shield was uh, taking some pressure there. Well, I'd love to see the gyro thrown up. Really uh, disadvantages the the Rob. Takes his gyro out of the out of the match for a little bit. Oh yeah, looks like Jack's from having trouble winning neutral. Looks like they're kind of getting controlled by the next next and fast. Punches the rotor arms with the back air. Gonna, gonna get rid of that stock. Jack's down to just one stock. It's looking rough for, looking rough for Jack's throne, but uh, could easily kill the Polio. Kill next and get back into this. And I really want to see what Astrum can, can pull off with the uh, five Sora. Ooh, looks so like we got some team combos on fast. Giving him a hard time. Next coming in to save, but oh wow, amazing back air and doesn't even kill his teammate Astrum able to avoid the hit. So it's looking a bit better for the Jackstrom. So everybody's just strapping. This is kind of just a uh, classic uh, doubles technic this. Ooh, looks like uh, Charizard's not going to be able to make back the recovery back. You know what happened there. I love seeing Squirtles just coming out and scrapping in these, uh, these big bodies. Of course, I mean, Fox isn't that too heavy, but Fox is doing, doing some damage here. You know, I gotta love, I love the way that Next is, uh, you know, really just keeping track of everyone, everyone on screen. Really having some good, good, uh, saves for her team here. Smash is gonna take take pass out. Oh, Jax, Jax looks like he's getting started, but the Charizard's struggling to make it back. Oh, no punish on the get up attack. Yep, the lasers coming across stage really are a big part of the doubles uh, the doubles matchup. Coming and hit everyone. Oh my gosh, that if that hit, that would have been crazy. Up smash, the down throw, back throw to up smash, whatever. But wow, the dash attack. Jackster may would play, take that one from behind. The dash attack just sliding in perfectly, perfect hitbox, taking the last stop and next out. So it's going to be 1 1. It's looking like this is really gearing up to be an interesting set. Uh, so yeah. Team battle. Yep, not going to have any changes to the team comp, and really the only change that I would expect is maybe if uh, Astrum wanted to play Byleth instead of P uh, PT. But I mean, the PT's working out, that survivability that Charizard brings to the table seems to be, uh, seems to be going to good utilization. Oh, 
right, looking very even, much like the last game coming in, coming into this uh, third game of the set. Ooh, looking like some saucy, saucy jab locks. Fast pulling. I mean, Fox is great at jab locking, in my opinion. Ooh, wow, great punish, being able to see the Charizard player blitzing across the screen, getting rid of that stock, giving the fast, the next and fast, and early really lead. Good getup attack comes in, clears, clears uh, out some space on stage, allows Jackstrom to get back on the stage. Nope, oh, slides in with the back air, doesn't see it coming. Okay, I didn't know the down smash could hit below the platform like that, but that makes sense. Wow, punishes that down throw. Looks like Jax is trying to get the rotor arms kill off, but uh, let's be honest, he fishes up for that way too much sometimes. Really been uh, sticking to these corners, it feels like. Uh, playing the doubles match, half off stage. I mean, I would say all of these characters are quite competent uh, at, with edge guarding and playing off stage. This is really hectic, just uh, hitboxes everywhere, just people throwing up smashes, taking stocks like that. Ooh, unfortunate. The back air. I don't know. I don't even know how Jax avoided that back air, but it looks like it's gonna end up taking out fast instead. Uh, once again, putting Jax and Astro back in the game from a mistake like that. This is the one-one set. So this is the flex game. So I'm just gonna get the counter picks going into the into game five. Wow, the rotor arm's just setting up a wall of hitboxes that Fast is unable to pass through. Jackstrom looking very comfortable right now. Next, his last stock is gone, but Fast is very low, so let's see what let's see what can happen. This is a very interesting situation. Fast is able to kill either of these guys so easily, but I think Jax and Astrom are really gonna try to, to cook him up with the team combos here. Fast doing very good being the only one alive. Seems like Charizard's a little slow, not able to punish him with too much without uh, Astrom worrying about hitting his teammate. And Astrom just struggling to get back on stage. Keeping fast all this time to put more damage on Jax. And wow, that does a lot of shield damage, which makes sense because the move does like 40% damage, but uh... But, ooh, the footstool, ooh, I thought the footstool missed, missed tech on the footstool on the platform was going to be it, but now one stock is gone, it's so close to fast, he could really take this back, this long, uh, this game has gone on for a while, but, uh, looks like he doesn't have the best DI, and with the rage on Rob, he's going to be able to take that game. So, good job to Jackson Astrum, going up 2-1 in the set. Alright, so now we are on to game four. Uh, Jackson Astrum on match set for being in winner side grands. I want to see what the Squirtle does, how long the Squirtle stays out. I have not seen much of the Squirtle in the doubles because uh, it's understandable. I feel like small bodies are difficult in doubles. Amazing save with the get up attack for the rapid jab. It's like Jackstone kind of like keeping their 
teammates that are opponent zone to one side. Now they're finally able to break through, break out, get some more stage control. Finally making it look like more of a scramble instead of just Jackson Astrum controlling the pace. Now I've got to say that these matches, these games have been insanely even. Um, it's just people scrapping. Uh, you know, it looks like next is going to be the first one to drop a stock. But this is really anyone. I would not be surprised if we used to see a repeat of, of uh, these teams in Grand Finals. Jack's putting in work with some of his uh, down tilts. It's broken down. And Astro letting rip for the F smash but not finding anyone. It's like next in the edge guard opportunity. Puts himself off puts himself off stage, not sure what he's doing. Now next day we'll slide in the back air, get rid of some stocks, making it look a little bit for, better for next and pass. Once again, seeing the, the Squirtle not out for too long before switching over to the Ivasaur. Ivasaur definitely being more a little more versatile with uh, the coverage it moves give you. Wow, I'm surprised that a uh, drop down up air killed, but such a good hitbox. And an another one on, on fast, just racking up those, those KOs. Uh, it's looking like it's three stocks apiece per team, so. So yeah, I don't think we've seen any share stocks yet, so I wonder if that's if that might happen here. Looking like Jack's about to lose his uh, last stock. It really looks like Nex and Bass are pulling in the lead here. Jack stalling high, trying to avoid whatever whatever Nex is throwing out of him. Oh, and great catch with the up air. Nex able to get a kill. And now it's just, they're just starting up the combo. Oh, Astro, I'm doing his best to fight his way out of this corner. Now they're goofing around. They're uh, <laughs> grabbing each other. Ooh. Yeah, it's just really, really covering really great. I'm surprised that that didn't spike, but uh, yeah, next and fast, making it extremely hard for Astrum to breathe, to do anything, get any damage. So uh, now it's 2-2. Now it's We're going to game five for uh, winner's finals. Alright, so let's see what, um, let's see what happens game five. Still no changes to the team call. Grabs coming in early. I haven't seen like the upbeat come in. Looks like everyone's playing pretty conservative here. It's like next and fast taking a slight uh, lead percentage wise. Okay, wow, Astrum and, Astrum and Next fighting deep off stage, and you know how Next is sliding in that back there. Jack's really not looking ready for, for that. It's like he was occupied with some attacks. I've seen a little bit of the 1v1s, but every time we split up into the 1v1s, we kind of see Max just, just run across stage and she just kind of, kind of puts an end to that. 
Ooh, that, uh... That forward it. Forward smash. I don't even know what that caught. Might have been a jump. But, uh... Good stuff. I would say next is looking a lot more confident in this game. You know, it seems like she was able to eliminate some of the mistakes that uh, she was making earlier. Jackson Ash was still able to find a, some team combos in the midst of everything. Jack's well gripping that, that uh, the rotor arms off stage. Jack's stalling Glopius too. It's, uh, it's like all hell's breaking loose on the ledge. And it's not looking too good for Jax and Astrum, both down to their last stock. Uh, Jack's pretty high percentage. Looks like he was setting up for trying to see if, he could, if she could uh, next and pull him in place for the kill. And the up air is gonna gonna dispose of the fox quite easily, but it might not be enough with the lead they have. Looks like it's just Astrum, and he has quite a bit to go. And I don't know if... Okay, switches to the Charizard, interesting. I don't know if that's who you want to be playing in this situation, but uh, of course it's going to get better survivability. But now getting thrown into a jab lock. Wow, passing off to a jab lock. That's, that's kind of crazy. But, uh, yeah, just the team combos continue to come. And it's looking like, what do you do here? <laughs> okay, that... This is uh, some brutal, some brutal traps. And the flare blitz, the flare blitz takes them both out. That is, that's smart. That's smart. He knows what he's doing. And just trying to get a spike, trying to get something that will get him back into having a chance at this. But oh my gosh, and the down air is just not enough. Once again. And then, okay, yeah, gonna be able to catch the uh, the flare blitz pretty easily with the, the up air, and yeah, next and fast take it. So they will be headed next and fast, or headed to grand finals, winner side.